got a mystery wrapped in a conundrum right now. This is crazy. You know the fight between Jimmy Kimmel and Aaron Rodgers? Well, Aaron Rodgers was mysteriously I, cut. I mysteriously beg to cut differ. Today. I don't see a mystery here at all. Oh, and I you do. were asking the question yesterday, who wins in this battle between Jimmy Kimmel and Aaron Rodgers? It ain't over. It's it Jimmy. ain't over. I, it ain't over. It's Jimmy Kimmel, and we know this. The reason I'm saying it's Jimmy Kimmel, and you will come around to saying it's Jimmy Kimmel, nope. is because Pat McAfee started his show today by announcing that Aaron Rodgers will no longer be a part. Well, here's what he here's what he yeah. said. It's Tuesday, season four is uh, done. Yeah. Ah, oh, complete Man. season. There's going to be a lot of people that are happy with that, myself included, to be honest. With the way it ended, it got real loud mm -hmm. and uh, real loud. I'm happy that that is not going to be my mentions going forward, mm -hmm. which is great news. We are very lucky to get a chance to chat with him and learn from him. Some of his thoughts and opinions, though, do piss off a lot of people. A lot of people. And uh, I'm pumped that that is no longer going to be every single Wednesday of my life, uh, which it has been for the last few weeks. On Friday, obviously, I threw us into the fire as well. Forever stand by that. Everything else, though, <laughs> like, just can't do that and not what we want to be known for. Hmm. So what do you mean? Oh, that's when he called out the ESPN exec. Right. But uh, as far as Aaron, it sounds like Pat is celebrating this. He's like, I don't want to deal with this mess anymore. So how do you say that okay. Jimmy Kimmel didn't win? I will tell you how. Jimmy Kimmel's, uh, no. well, Jimmy Kimmel's first thing was to say to Pat McAfee, why do you have this idiot on your show? Right. Right? Uh -huh. Well, guess what? He's not on his show. And my feeling is this, that this is not Pat McAfee necessarily talking about what he believes, that there is a whole hierarchy at Disney that has a problem, uh, let me just make my point, has a problem with politics inserted into content there, and that the executives right. leaned in hard on him. He complained about the executives as well as Aaron Rodgers. Mm -hmm. I think this is good for Pat's business because the bottom line is you want ears and eyeballs, and he was getting that with Aaron Rodgers.